Thomas Randell was dying of lung cancer. And he had a secret. In March 2021, she made striking confession at head of bed with her daughter in Boston suburb following first chemotherapy session she was fugitive and had been on run for over 50 years, at more than 50 years ago. She was fugitive. At age of 20, he had stolen $215,000 from bank in Ohio. His real name was Theodore Conrad, not Thomas Randell. He begged his daughter not to look at the case. However, after this statement, which had a effect, Ashley Randell did not sleep much that night. So he did what most curious people would do. I am alone in bedroom of my childhood. And I searched Google for Ted Conrad missing. And the first thing that came out was the police officer robbed bank. Oh my God. This is my father. He said to CNN. And there were hundreds of articles about him. With each click. His father's dark past was unraveling before his eyes. In Linfield, Massachusetts, Thomas Randell was a car salesman and golf club professional who admired his wife and only child. He was very fond of his daughter and came to football matches with khaki pants and fast cars. Ironically, his daughter also donated to local police charities and spent hours watching NCIS and other criminal programs but in Cleveland. He was Ted Conrad, a bank robber who was hard to catch. Inspired by his favorite film, The Thomas Crown Affair, he had just emerged from his adolescence when he carried out one of the greatest heists in Ohio. History. Conrad's infantile face hung on the wanted posters and was America's most wanted and unresolved. Mysteries. And a pair of Fatherson U. S. Police officers in Cleveland made it their mission to capture him. And there are millions of articles about you. Ashley Randell, 38, who is hosting a new podcast about who her father is and what drove her to rob a bank, said, and we should tell my mother too. About a day after father's shocking announcement, Ashley told CNN that she had pulled her mother Kathy aside and told about the incident. I read articles on the internet and he said oh my god. Ashley Randell. Oh my god. He's known her for more than 40 years. And I can't imagine how traumatic it is for her to learn this great secret. His father was obsessed with the movie Steve McQueen. Which described a bank robbery. Conrad's disappearance surprised researchers for 50 years. Some have compared it to 1971's case of Pirate D. B. Cooper, who parachuted from plane with $200,000 in cash and disappeared into vast wilderness of Pacific Northwest, was never seen again. Conrad's robbery sounded like a movie story. On July 11, 1969, he started working as a teller at the Society National Bank in Cleveland. It was Friday and it was his birthday. So during the break he bought a bottle of whiskey and a pack of cigarettes. At end of the day, he went to safe, quietly stuffed $215,000 into a paper bag and moved away from his old life. The bank robbery only got 